The next step in the development of backend API for our real time chat application is to have a database in place. In this course, we are going to use MongoDB database for storing the chat application data like the users, messages, etc. MongoDB is a non-relational NoSQL database solution. In this course, I'm not going to go into the details of MongoDB database and its features. If you want to learn about MongoDB in detail, you can check out my complete MongoDB course on my channel. Also, we are not going to use the local installation of MongoDB. Instead, we are going to use a MongoDB database hosted on cloud using Atlas. Atlas is a cloud service provided by MongoDB company for hosting MongoDB database on cloud and that database can be accessed from anywhere in the world. And since we are going to host the database on cloud, to connect and manipulate data in that hosted database, we need an interface in our local machine. For that, we are going to install MongoDB Compass. Now, in order to download and install MongoDB Compass, first you need to go to mongodb.com. Once you are in this web page, from the products, you can go to tools, and in the tools, you will see this Compass option. You can simply click on that and it will take you to the page from where you can download MongoDB Compass. Now, MongoDB Compass is a GUI application which we can use to connect to a MongoDB database and write and execute MongoDB commands. So, in this lecture, let's go ahead and let's download and install MongoDB Compass. Then, in the next lecture, we will create a MongoDB database on the cloud and we will connect to that database from our local machine using this MongoDB Compass. So let's go ahead and let's download and install MongoDB Compass. To download MongoDB Compass, we are going to click on this download now button. It will take us to this page. So in the tools, you can see that we have this option MongoDB Compass download. If you scroll down, from here, you can select the version of MongoDB Compass which you want to download. Then here, you can also select the platform for which you want to download the MongoDB Compass. Now, in my case, I'm using Windows operating system 64-bit. So that operating system is automatically selected here. And then from here, you can select the type of package which you want to install. Now, from the platform, what I'm going to do is I'm going to select Windows 64-bit and I'm going to select this MSI because here I want to download an MSI package. I don't want to download an EXE. I want to download an MSI package. MSI stands for Microsoft Installer. So here I want to download an installer and when we will execute that installer, it will install MongoDB Compass on my operating system. Now let's go ahead and let's click on this download button and it will start downloading the MSI file for this MongoDB Compass. So the download of MSI file has been completed. Let's click on that MSI file and it is going to open a window for installing MongoDB Compass. Okay, so this MongoDB Compass setup window has opened. In the first page, let's click on this next button. Then from here, we can select the path where we want to install MongoDB Compass. I'm going to keep the default path here and I'll click on this next button. And finally, let's click on this install button to install MongoDB Compass. And the installation of MongoDB Compass is complete. Let's click on this finish button. And now let's go ahead and let's open MongoDB Compass. So for that, I've just typed Compass in the search bar. And here you can see that option, MongoDB Compass. Let's click on that. It will open that GUI. As you can see, it has opened that GUI. Now here, we need to specify the connection string to connect to our MongoDB database. Now, we have not created any MongoDB database yet. That we are going to do in our next lecture. And once we will create our MongoDB database in the cloud, we will copy its connection string and we will provide that connection string here. And then we will connect to that database from this GUI. So in this lecture, we learned what is MongoDB Compass and how we can download and install MongoDB Compass in our local machine.